Breaking news on mortgages. Diana Olick has that for us. Uh, Diana, good morning. Good morning, Mike. Yeah, a major break from the FHFA regarding loans sold to Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac. It just announced that it will buy mortgages that went into forbearance just after they closed. That is the government's program, which allows borrowers hit by COVID-19 uh, economically to miss some of their mortgage payments. Now, they had stopped doing that, and that had really frozen up the credit market, made it much more difficult to get a loan because most lenders do sell their loans either to Fannie Mae, Freddie Mac, or Ginnie Mae, and they were worried that they were going to be stuck with some of these loans. So FHFA announcing they will buy these loans that meet specific criteria for a limited period of time. That is up to May 31st. They say that the loans must have closed on or after February 1st, and the loan must be a mortgage purchase, no cash out refis on this one, and the loan cannot be more than 30 days delinquent. Now, um, Mark Calabria, who is the FHFA regulator, said, we are focused on keeping the mortgage market working for current and future homeowners during these challenging times. Purchases of these previously ineligible loans will help provide liquidity to mortgage markets and allow originators to keep lending. Now, there will be a price premium on this for those lenders, 5%. For first time home buyers and 7% for non first time home buyers. So it will make these loans more expensive. It makes it, it may actually increase the rates on these loans because they're more expensive. But again, it will open up that credit box just a little bit, which had tightened up substantially over the last several weeks.